I'm Katya Popova from the National Oceanography Center and my area of expertise is ocean modeling and ecological connectivity. When we think about the high seas from a coastal perspective, the high seas look very far away and not really very important. But nothing is further from the truth, because there is growing scientific evidence that high seas are tightly connected to the ocean coast. And this evidence comes from two major directions. One is uh, migration by uh, ocean but by marine uh, animals so species like sharks species like turtles they migrate hundreds and thousands of kilometers they forage they reproduce in the high seas and they're very important for coastal community both from socio-economic point of view and cultural point of view and any disturbance of the corridors in the high seas through which these species migrate will have noticeable impact on these communities. And another line of evidence is coming from the connectivity via ocean circulation. So vigorous ocean currents move larvae of marine animals around and connect together ecosystem in distant, uh, in, uh, distant location. So when we think about ocean connectivity, lots of people realize that yes, ocean is a connected system, but not many people realize how fast this connection, how tight this connection is. So a simple example, imagine throwing, uh, imagine throwing millions and millions of rubber ducks in, uh, in the ocean from the high seas and think about how soon these rubber ducks will begin to arrive to the coastline. Well, the answer to it is they will start arriving within about a month's time. That's how tightly these areas are connected to each other. 